In mathematics, and more specifically in linear algebra and functional analysis, the kernel also known as null space or null space of a linear map L, V W between two vector spaces V and W, is the set of all elements V of V for which L v equals 0, where 0 denotes the zero vector in W that is, in set builder notation, ker L equals V element of V L V equals zero. Display style ker L equals left math BF V in V mid L math BF V equals math BF zero right text. Topic Properties The kernel of L is a linear subspace of the domain V. In the linear map L, V W, two elements of V have the same image in W if and only if the difference lies in the kernel of L. L V 1 equals L V 2 L V 1 minus V 2 equals 0 display style L math BF V underscore 1 equals L math BF V underscore 2 left right arrow L math BF V underscore 1 math BF V underscore 2 equals math BF 0 text it follows that the image of L is isomorphic to the quotient of V by the kernel I M L V ker L display style mathop mathrum im L kong v ker L text this implies the rank nullity theorem dim ker L plus dim i m L equals dim v Display style dim ker l plus dim mathop mathrum im l equals dim v text, where by rank we mean the dimension of the image of l, and by nullity that of the kernel of l. When v is an inner product space, the quotient v ker l can be identified with the orthogonal complement in v of ker l. This is the generalization to linear operators of the row space or coimage of a matrix. Topic. Application to modules The notion of kernel applies to the homomorphisms of modules, the latter being a generalization of the vector space over a field to that over a ring. The domain of the mapping is a module, and the kernel constitutes a submodule. Here, the concepts of rank and nullity do not necessarily apply. In functional analysis If V and W are topological vector spaces and W is finite dimensional then a linear operator L, V W is continuous if and only if the kernel of L is a closed subspace of V. Representation as matrix multiplication Consider a linear map represented as AM times N matrix A with coefficients in a field K, typically the field of the real numbers or of the complex numbers, and operating on column vectors X with N components over K. The kernel of this linear map is the set of solutions to the equation AX equals 0, where 0 is understood as the zero vector. The dimension of the kernel of A is called the nullity of A. In set builder notation, N A equals null a equals ker a equals x element of k n a x equals 0 Display style operator name n a equals operator name null a equals operator name ker a equals left math bf x in k caret n a math bf x equals math bf zero right. The matrix equation is equivalent to a homogeneous system of linear equations. A 
x equals 0 a 11 x 1 plus a 12 x 2 plus plus a 1 n x n equals 0 a 21 x 1 plus a 22 x 2 plus plus a 2 n x n equals 0 a m 1 x 1 plus a m 2 x 2 plus plus a m n x n equals zero. Display style at math bf x equals math bf zero. Left right arrow. Begin aligned at seven or underscore eleven x underscore one and then plus and under underscore twelve x underscore two and then plus c d o t s plus and under underscore one n x underscore n and then equals and then then zero or underscore twenty one x underscore one and then plus and under underscore twenty two x underscore two and then plus C D O T S plus and under underscore two N X underscore N and then equals and then then zero V D O T S and then 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 V D O T S and then 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 V D O T S and then 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 V D O T S are underscore M one X underscore one and then plus and under underscore M two X underscore two and then plus C D O T S plus and under underscore Minnesota X underscore N and then equals and then then zero text end a at thus the kernel of A is the same as the solution set to the above homogeneous equations. Subspace properties The kernel of an M times N matrix A over a field K is a linear subspace of knots. That is, the kernel of A, the set null A, has the following three properties. Null A always contains the zero vector, since A O equals zero. If X element of null A and Y element of null A, then X plus Y element of null A. This follows from the distributivity of matrix multiplication over addition. If X element of null A and C is a scalar C element of K, then C X element of null A, since A C X. Topic C X. C zero equals zero equals topic the row space of a matrix equals the product X can be written in terms of the dot product of vectors as follows a x equals o one x a 2 x a m x display style at math bf x equals begin b matrix math bf underscore 1 c d o t math bf x math bf underscore 2 c d o t math bf x v d o t s math bf underscore m c d o t math bf x end b matrix here a 1 and denote the rows of the matrix A. It follows that X is in the kernel of A if and only if X is orthogonal or perpendicular to each of the row vectors of A, because when the dot product of two vectors is equal to zero, they are by definition orthogonal. The row space, or coimage, of a matrix A is the span of the row vectors of A by the above reasoning. The kernel of A is the orthogonal complement to the row space. That is, a vector x lies in the kernel of A if and only if it is perpendicular to every vector in the row space of A. The dimension of the row space of A is called the rank of A, and the dimension of the kernel of A is called the nullity of A. These quantities are related by the rank nullity theorem. Rank A plus nullity A 
equals n display style operator name rank a plus operator name nullity a equals n topic left null space The left null space, or co-kernel, of a matrix A consists of all vectors x such that x t a equals 0 t, where t denotes the transpose of a column vector. The left null space of A is the same as the kernel of it, the left null space of A is the orthogonal complement to the column space of A, and is dual to the co-kernel of the associated linear transformation. The kernel, the row space, the column space, and the left null space of A are the four fundamental subspaces associated to the matrix A equals topic non-homogeneous systems of linear equations equals the kernel also plays a role in the solution to a non-homogeneous system of linear equations a x equals b or a 11 x one plus a twelve x two plus plus a one n x n equals b one a twenty one x one plus Twenty two x two plus plus a two N x N equals B two A M one x one plus M two by two plus plus A M N X N equals B M display style at Math BF X equals Math BF B text or begin align at at seven or underscore eleven X underscore one and then plus and under underscore twelve X underscore two and then plus C D O T S plus and under underscore one N X underscore N and then equals and then then B underscore one or underscore twenty one X underscore one and then plus and under underscore twenty two X underscore Score two and then plus C D O T S plus and under underscore two N X underscore N and then equals and then then B underscore two V D O T S and then 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 V D O T S and then 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 V D O T S and then 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 V D O T S are underscore M one X underscore one and then plus and under underscore M two X underscore two and then plus C D O T S plus and under underscore Minnesota X underscore N and then equals and then then b underscore m end aligned at if u and v are two possible solutions to the above equation, then a u minus v equals a u minus a v equals b minus b equals zero. Display style math bf u math bf v equals a math bf u a math bf v equals math bf b math bf b equals math bf zero. Thus, the difference of any two solutions to the equation x equals b lies in the kernel of a. It follows that any solution to the equation x equals b can be expressed as the sum of a fixed solution v and an arbitrary element of the kernel. That is, the solution set to the equation x equals b is v plus x a v equals b x element of null Display style left math bf v plus math bf x mid math bf v equals math bf b land math bf x in operator name null a right. Geometrically, this says that the solution set to x equals b is the translation of the kernel of a by the vector v. See also Fredholm alternative and flat geometry. Equals. Topic illustration equals we give here a simple illustration of computing the kernel of a matrix see section computation by Gaussian elimination below for methods better suited to more complex calculations we also touch on the row space and its relation to the kernel 
Consider the matrix A equals 235 minus 423, display style equals begin B matrix, 2 and 3 and 5 minus 4 and 2 and 3, end B matrix. The kernel of this matrix consists of all vectors x, y, z element of R3 for which 235-423 x, y, z equals 00 display style begin B matrix 2 and 3 and 5 minus 4 and 2 and 3 end B matrix begin B matrix x, y, z end B matrix equals begin B matrix 0 0 end B matrix which can be expressed as a homogeneous system of linear equations involving x, y, and z two x plus 3y plus 5z equals 0 minus 4x plus 2y plus 3z equals 0 display style begin align at 7 2x and and plus and and 3y and and plus and and 5z and and equals and and 0 4x and and plus and and 2y and and plus and and 3z and and equals and and 0 end align at which can be written in matrix form as 2350 minus 4230 display style left begin array c c c c 2 and 3 and 5 5 and 0 minus 4 and 2 and 3 and 0 end array right gauss jordan elimination reduces this to 101/16/001 and 13/8/0 display style left begin array c c c c 1 and 0 and 1/16 and 0 0 and 1 and 13/8 and 0 end array right rewriting yields x equals minus 1/16 z y equals minus 13/8 z display style begin align at at 7 x equals and then frac 1/16 z y equals and then frac 13/8 z End aligned at. Now we can express an element of the kernel x, y, z equals c minus one sixteen minus thirteen eight one. Display style begin B matrix X, Y, Z, end B matrix equals C, begin B matrix minus one sixteenth minus thirteen eighths one end B matrix for C A scalar. Since C is a free variable, this can be expressed equally well as X, Y, Z equals C minus one minus Twenty six sixteen Display style begin B matrix X, Y, Z, end B matrix equals C, begin B matrix minus one minus twenty six sixteen end B matrix. The kernel of A is precisely the solution set to these equations, in this case, a line through the origin in R3, the vector minus 1, minus 26, 16 T constitutes a basis of the kernel of A, thus, the nullity of A is one. Note also that the following dot products are 0, 2, 3, 5, minus 1, minus 26, 16, equals 0, a n d, minus 4, 2, 3, minus 1, minus 26, 16, equals 0. Display style left begin array c c c 2 and 3 and 5 end array right c d o t begin b matrix minus 1, minus 26, 16 end b matrix equals 0 quad mathrm and quad left begin array c c c minus 4 and 2 and 3 end array right c d o t begin b matrix minus 1 minus 26 16 end b matrix equals 0 mathrm which illustrates that vectors in the kernel of a are orthogonal to each of the row vectors of a these two linearly independent row vectors span the row space of a a plane orthogonal to the vector minus 1 minus 26 16 t with the rank 2 of a the nullity 1 of a and the dimension 3 of a we have an illustration of the rank nullity theorem Topic Examples If L, room R N, then the kernel of L is the solution set to a homogeneous system of linear equations. As in the above illustration, if L is the operator L x one x two x three equals two x one plus 3 x 2 plus 5 x 3 
minus 4 x 1 plus 2 x 2 plus 3 x 3 Display style L x underscore one x underscore two x underscore three equals two x underscore one plus three x underscore two plus five x underscore three four x underscore one plus two x underscore two plus three x underscore three. Then the kernel of L is the set of solutions to the equations two x one plus three x two plus 5 times 3 equals 0 minus 4 by 1 plus 2 by 2 plus 3 times 3 equals 0 display style begin aligned at 7 2 x underscore 1 and plus and 3 x underscore 2 and plus and 5 x underscore 3 and equals and 0 4 x underscore 1 and plus and 2 x underscore 2 and plus and 3 x underscore 3 and equals and 0 end aligned at let's see 0 1 denote the vector space of of all continuous real valued functions on the interval 0 1 and define l c 0 1 r by the rule l f equals f 0.3 display style l f equals f 0.3 text then the kernel of l consists of all functions f element of c 0 1 for which f 0.3 equals 0 let C infinity R be the vector space of all infinitely differentiable functions R R, and let D C infinity R C infinity R be the differentiation operator D F equals D F D X display style D F equals frac D F D X text then the kernel of D consists of all functions in C infinity R, whose derivatives are zero, i.e. the set of all constant functions, let R infinity be the direct product of infinitely many copies of R, and let S, R infinity R infinity be the shift operator. S x 1 x 2 x 3 x 4 equals x 2 x 3 x 4 display style s x underscore 1 x underscore 2 x underscore 3 x underscore 4 l dots equals x underscore 2 x underscore 3 x underscore 4 l dots text then the kernel of s is the one dimensional subspace consisting of all vectors x 1 0 0 if V is an inner product space and W is a subspace, the kernel of the orthogonal projection V W is the orthogonal complement to W in V. Topic: <laughs> Computation by Gaussian elimination. A basis of the kernel of a matrix may be computed by Gaussian elimination. For this purpose, given an M times N matrix A, we construct first the row augmented matrix A I display style left begin array C A line I end array right, where I is the N times N identity matrix. Computing its column echelon form by Gaussian elimination or any other suitable method, we get a matrix B C display style left begin array c b line c end array right a basis of the kernel of a consists in the non zero columns of c such that the corresponding column of b is a zero column in fact the computation may be stopped as soon as the upper matrix is in column echelon form the remainder of the computation consists in changing the basis of the vector space generated by the columns whose upper part is zero for example, suppose that a equals 10 minus 302 minus 80150 minus 140017 minus 9000000. Display style equals left begin array c c c c c c 1 and 0 and minus 3 and 0 and 2 and minus 8 0 and 1 and 5 and 0 and minus 1 and 4 0 and 0 and 0 and 1 and 7 and minus 9 0 and 0 and 0 and 0 and 0 and 0 end array right. Then a i 
equals 1 0 minus 3 0 2 minus 8 0 1 5 0 minus 1 4 0 0 0 1 7 minus 9 0 0 0 0 0 0 1 0 0 0 0 O O one O O O O 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 O O one Display style left begin array C A line I end array right equals left begin array C C C C C C one and zero and minus three and zero and two and minus eight zero and one and five and zero and minus one and four zero and zero and zero and one and seven and minus nine zero and zero and zero and zero and zero and zero line one and zero and zero and zero and zero and zero zero and one and zero and zero and zero and zero zero and zero and one and zero and zero and zero zero and zero and zero and one and zero and zero zero and zero and zero and zero and one and zero zero and zero and zero and zero and zero and one end array right Putting the upper part in column echelon form by column operations on the whole matrix gives B C equals one zero 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 one zero 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 one zero 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 one zero zero three minus Two eight oh one oh minus five one minus four O O O one O O O O one O minus seven nine O O O O one O O O O O O one Display style left begin array C B line C end array right equals left begin array C C C C C C one and zero and zero and zero and zero and zero zero and one and zero and zero and zero and zero zero and zero and one and zero and zero and zero and zero zero and zero and zero and zero and zero and zero line one and zero and zero and three and minus two and eight zero and one and zero and minus five and one and minus four zero and zero and zero and one and zero and zero zero and zero and one and zero and minus seven and nine zero and zero and zero and zero and one and zero zero and zero and zero and zero and zero and one end array right the last three columns of B are zero columns Therefore, the three last vectors of C three minus five one zero 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 minus two one zero minus seven one zero eight minus four zero Nine zero one Display style left begin array R three minus five one zero 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 end array right left begin array R minus two one zero minus seven one zero end array right left begin array R eight minus four zero nine zero one end array right are a basis of the kernel of A proof that the method computes the kernel since column operations correspond to post multiplication by invertible matrices the fact that a i display style left begin array c a line i end array right reduces to b c 
Display style left begin array C B line C end array right means that there exists an invertible matrix P display style P such that A I P equals B C display E style left begin array C A line I end array right P equals left begin array C B line C end array right with B display style B in column echelon form. Thus A P equals B display style A P equals B I P equals C display style I P equals C and A C equals B display style A C equals B a column vector v display style v belongs to the kernel of a display style that is a v equals 0 display style av equals 0 if and only b w equals 0 display style bw equals 0 where w equals p minus 1 v equals c minus 1 v display style w equals p caret minus 1 v equals c caret minus 1 v as b display style b is in column echelon form b w equals 0 display style b w equals 0 if and only if the non zero entries of w display style w correspond to the zero columns of b display style b by multiplying by c display style c one may deduce that this is the case if and only if v equals c w display style v equals c w is a linear combination of the corresponding columns of c display style c topic numerical computation The problem of computing the kernel on a computer depends on the nature of the coefficients. Topic: <laughs> Exact coefficients. If the coefficients of the matrix are exactly given numbers, the column echelon form of the matrix may be computed by Bayes algorithm more efficiently than with Gaussian elimination. It is even more efficient to use modular arithmetic and Chinese remainder theorem, which reduces the problem to several similar ones over finite fields this avoids the overhead induced by the non-linearity of the computational complexity of integer multiplication. For coefficients in a finite field, Gaussian elimination works well, but for the large matrices that occur in cryptography and Grobner basis computation, better algorithms are known, which have roughly the same computational complexity, but are faster and behave better with modern computer hardware. Topic. Floating point computation For matrices whose entries are floating point numbers, the problem of computing the kernel makes sense only for matrices such that the number of rows is equal to their rank. Because of the rounding errors, a floating point matrix has almost always a full rank, even when it is an approximation of a matrix of a much smaller rank. Even for a full rank matrix, it is possible to compute its kernel only if it is well conditioned, i.e., it has a low condition number. Even for a well conditioned full rank matrix, Gaussian elimination does not behave correctly, it introduces rounding errors that are too large for getting a significant result. 
As the computation of the kernel of a matrix is a special instance of solving a homogeneous system of linear equations, the kernel may be computed by any of the various algorithms designed to solve homogeneous systems. A state-of-the-art software for this purpose is the LEPAC library. See also <laughs> Notes <laughs>